Hey guys, it's Bella and welcome to my morning routine. So the very first thing I do is open my blinds because I need to see the natural light. It just helps me wake up every morning and lately I've been doing morning stretches because my lower back has actually been killing me and it's really just been helping to start the morning this way. I'm gonna fall back asleep. Anyways, after I push through and fight to stay awake, I um, <laughs> what do we, I usually just get on my phone for a while. I'm sorry, I'm so incompetent. I'm just on my phone, okay? Yum. Oh. I'm also always waking up super thirsty, so I make sure to have my bottle with me. And then my alarm went off because I'm dumb and don't know how to turn off my million alarms, so yeah. Hi, good morning, and welcome to my morning routine. I'm talking really low. Is this what you guys wanted? I actually do wake up at seven in the morning, so. Oh no, sisters. Okay, let's, no, I don't know how to use this shit, okay. Do you guys like my Scooby-Doo? Can you even see it? Oh my God, no. But yes, let's go make breakfast. Okay, so breakfast time. So here's me being super cute and then me taking out the really yummy pinkies. It's microwaving. Okay, sis. Anyway, here's me opening the fridge and taking out some extra ingredients, including my pinkies from the microwave, and then me freaking out over some almond milk um, whipped cream, which actually didn't work, so I had to throw away, and then some light syrup. And then here's me thumbsing up and also covering the Germex and Lysol because, you know, pandemic quarantine time. So then here's me being an incredible chef and starting to put uh, the wonderful syrup over my pinkies and the load of whipped cream. If any of you judge my whipped cream amount, I will scream. Look how cute that looks. Okay, and then I started putting a bunch of banana. I know it might look kind of gross, but it's yummy. Something I do every morning is have orange juice. I need to have that vitamin C. And my grandma likes to make some natural ones, but you know, she's asleep, so. Listen, it's not like the cutest, healthiest thing, but it's healthy and really yummy, and I'm gonna devour this so happy monday because i'm having pancakes on monday so so here's the best part as i eat my breakfast i really like to listen to podcasts or watch videos usually i watch uh zane and heath's unfiltered podcast it's the best and as soon as that's done i immediately start writing my to-do list and what i want to get done the rest of the day kind of the rest of my routine and it's just a really fun way to start getting ready and motivating myself i also like to kind of put some color into it motivational quote and then I get back into bed. Yeah, you heard me right. I get back into bed and I take 30 to 45 minutes every morning to just do something that makes me happy. And right now, that's reading. And I know it seems like a lot and it seems like a waste of time in the morning, but trust me, it makes the world of a difference. For you, it could be working out, finishing a podcast, anything. And then I get to make my bed. I make my bed every single morning. It's an imperative part of my routine. And without making my bed, I cannot get through my day. So here's my outfit. Very simple, very comfy. I love my Hamilton sweaters, I love hoodies, I love leggings, and it's just, I don't know, fun. Oh, and here are my slides. I don't wear shoes. Okay, so skincare. So of course, I start my morning, pick up my hair, brush my teeth, do the fun things, and then comes St. Ives Acne Control. I live by this scrub. It works so well. It always makes me feel so refreshed every morning, and my face has been breaking out from being inside all day, so it's really been helping. Uh, contacts. Hate them, but need them. And then my Pond's Dry Skin Cream, which I live by. I put this on every morning, and yeah, that's about it. And... I really don't do much for my skin, so yeah, let's continue. Hi, I just brushed my hair. You know it's great that it's Florida and it's hot as hell and this is what I'm wearing. See, that's the only thing though, the dry skin cream, it makes my skin look greasy, but it feels really dewy. It doesn't feel greasy at all. Okay, well, as you can see, more light has come in. <laughs> so this is the last and final step to my morning routine and possibly the very most important. This whole time you must have been like, let me see it. You, this, oh. this whole time you must have been like, Bella, where is your coffee? Sis, you need that. I make my iced coffee for class. 
so let's do that. So to make my iced coffee, I basically use two very simple steps. Starbucks medium roast unsweetened iced coffee, hazelnut creamer. This is not the one I usually get, but we're in a pandemic, so I'm not trying to be picky. Um, this is all they had, so it's gonna do. My Starbucks, my, my Starbucks cup. Okay, tell me that doesn't look like heaven. I cannot handle this. I'm probably gonna go get one right now. Nothing's ever good if you don't get a little dirty. Oh my god, I have to cut that out. Before $4 for every one of these bottles, I go through about two or three a week. So these are so much better and it's so much more um, cost efficient. I don't know, cost effective. I sound so stupid. I just Let's go get our learning on. Hey, really? What time is it? Oh my god, it's summer class, okay. I'm gonna be 100% real. I do this every day. I hate being rushed in the morning. Every time I rush in the morning, I feel like I, I've started off on the wrong foot already. So I highlighted some things here that I make every morning. Like, they make me want to wake up. I know these times are extremely rough and being positive seems mostly impossible. My grandma just making a lot of noise after I told her I'm literally starting class. It's fine. I know it's hard for a lot of people to literally get out of bed and have to go to class through their computer. This is just an example of what I do that actually gets me out of bed, that makes me feel good, makes me feel ready. It kind of sets you up for the motivation to work out later, to want to do more work and do that kind of thing. There's nothing in here that I've added that is not true. So I don't know if that, if any of this helped anyone, but it definitely Definitely makes my day when I do it, so hopefully it makes yours. I hope that at least gave you some idea, maybe some peace of mind. Thank you guys so much for watching, and let me know what else I should do. I feel like after this, I don't know, like something funny maybe. Okay.